Okay, so the solo, I guess, let's call it trailer. I mean, it gave away en enough here and there. So this, of course, is solo a Star Wars story. We get to see young Han, young Lando. Looking forward to young Lando. That should be pretty good. Young Chewie. Millennium Falcon. They also appear to be fighting a, an earlier version of like a TIE fighter. So you know what? It, it hit all the right notes. And of course it threw in a bunch of other characters came out. Oh, I have a feeling you're not going to be anywhere near as important as the three characters I already know. One of you is like, I know who you are. And he's like, really? What? Maybe that's a swear where it's like, you're, you know, you think you're a smuggler, you think you're a bad guy, but you're really a hero at heart. That could be the, the impetus that later on in A New Hope makes him go from like, I'm just in it for the money, kid. You, I'm not fighting the Empire. To, yeah, you know, I should back up, you know, save the day because, you know, I'm actually a good guy. You know, I come off gruff and hard, but, you know, I'm actually, I'm actually a pretty good guy. Seeing how young he is makes him there's probably enough time between where he is here and in A New Hope that we might not see him, you know, like, dump the spice. I'll be honest, I haven't read any of the synopses on this. I would almost love for it to be the moment where, you know, he he wins. He wins Blaine and Falcon. It'd be good to see him do something like that. You know, I would like to see it also be the time where, you know, he's dealing with Jabba. And that ends up being when you know, he ends up kind of being on the run for dumping the spice shipment. Still seems odd that if he's on the run from a gangster in Tatooine, why he would be in Mos Eisley on Tatooine. I get it, I mean, it's, it's, it's a big planet and all, you might be able to hide pretty convincingly in a place known for scum and villainy on a planet, but looks pretty interesting. And I think we're going to see a Jedi, I hope we see, I want to see a Force wielder similar to what we saw in Rogue One. I thought that was great. But it is enough to make me like, yeah. He's force sensitive, there's a kyber crystal, there's enough to make you go, yeah, yeah, it's the same universe as, as you know, space was with laser swords. It's the same universe. All in all, it looks like it'd be pretty good. Nice amount of action. They seem to have a pretty good flow when it comes to how they interacted. It does feel like a lot of the characters are probably going to be thrown in there to really not progress anywhere beyond this one film. But the three that I know of, Han, Lando, and Chewie, I'd like to see how they interacted with, with each other when they were younger. 